On any day, on any road, there's a moment state troopers dread. Uh, the walk. I can't, uh, I can't even begin really describe it to you. When you're walking that, that, that sidewalk to that front door. Troopers and others in Tennessee have made that walk 1,159 times so far this year to tell someone their loved one was in a crash and died. Your feet get heavier. Your steps are harder to take. It's almost you're walking in concrete. And when you try to raise your hand and knock on the door, it's, it's, it's like you're pulling the weight of the world up from your side to reach up to knock on the door. As a THP public information officer, you see Lieutenant Bill Miller's face at the scene of many of those crashes today. But he still remembers his first day like it was yesterday. When I was a young trooper, my first two fatalities were in one day. It was 1998, off Highway 249 in Cheatham County. She ran off road, jumped a guardrail, and went airborne into the, into the trees. Um, that stuck with me forever. It stuck with me forever. Two scenes, two victims. One 17 weeks pregnant, one 17 months old and both with the same name. Catherine, Catherine, never forget it. It's for the Catherines and every other name since that Lieutenant Miller says troopers do this job to encourage safe driving this Thanksgiving holiday and every day. To prevent having to feel and experience and share in that ungodly moment that, that we find ourselves in too many times to put an end to a walk that Miller says any trooper would be glad not to have to make. When we do it, we leave a part of ourselves with that family, and that's, uh, that's the gospel, that's as true as it can be. Jason Lamb, News Channel 5.